suddenly you're in sunny Sicily and the most beautiful beach on the whole island is Sola Bella. You'll fall in love with it. Look at the clear water, aquamarine, soft white pebbles. And then we walk up to Giovanni's, right up the steps with this gorgeous view. Sicilian delicacies, Prosecco, beer made in Sicily. And of course, we're going to be drinking wine. Lots of fun dinners at Tiny Gems that locals dine at. And here's Chefalu, the main piazza, a seaside gem. It's somewhat hidden in the winter. And then, of course, more wine. Sicilian wine is absolutely over the top. And Tarmina, this little town that the Ionians called the Pearl of the Mediterranean Sea. Isola Bella from the Eagle's Nest perch looking down where you're going to be staying at Villa Paradiso, a gem of a hotel with a stunning view in a quiet neighborhood off the main piazza, but steps from the buzz of shops, trattorias, and that 2,000-year-old amphitheater. Back to Chefalu, oh my gosh, Foodie Central. These chefs know what they're doing. I found this little hidden gem on a side street in Chefalu, about three blocks from my place where I was staying. It was absolutely delicious. Then I thought I'd dunk in in Isola Bella. This is February. Ooh, that felt good. <laughs> it's invigorating. And then the 2,000 year old amphitheater that you can walk to from Villa Paradiso. It's still where events are held a gorgeous view of the water. And then the vivid pinks and oranges of every single sunset below the mind-blowing Mount Etna, an active volcano. But don't worry, it just lets a lot of smoke out. You'll love it. Join me. Discover Sicily like a local.